Here we are, it is Friday, it is half past 12, half an hour to go. So hello, welcome to the vlog. There is something that YouTube really likes, and that is a good unboxing. So let's hope that this is gonna make a good unboxing. So yesterday we were on a Zoom call with Dave, who is my brother who's in the UK and uh, he was in his office and he happened to have a light in a diffuser box there um, that he had set up because he was filming he was filming a zoom call with us and uh, yeah on his I had spent the morning before the zoom call looking at lighting options for a reason I'll explain in a minute anyway seeing what he had and hearing how he had used it and how he was happy with it I thought no let's do this um, this is going to help us in what we're up to. So, yeah, we put in the order and uh, it actually arrived in less than 24 hours, which is, for here, quite something. So inside the blue plastic bag is a black bag. And inside the black bag is what we ordered. Another bag. And in this bag, uh -huh, that's important. And this, how do we do this? I guess that goes something like that. That's cool. And then we have, um, yeah, this, this diffuser that goes over the front of that, which we'll get out in a minute. Plugs, switches, so in here, little tripod, looks all right, yep, in here, woohoo, enormous bulb, that's half of it, the other half is another whole set of the same. So why, why have we decided it is the moment to pull the trigger on buying some sort of studio lights and diffusers. Well, Rowan um, was at the radio station, the local radio station here in Yates the other day, and they were asking her, you know, what about Novimost? What about, you know, would we want to make a program about the work we're doing? One of the things we are not doing right now is having a concert with the young people who are learning music with us because you can only have 30 people indoors and so if you have 20 young people who want to play in a concert you know half of them could bring one parent clearly that's not going to work um, as a concert scenario in the town theatre so we haven't had a concert for well over a year now and uh, it's a shame you know we kept saying to young people when we can we're going to do one but we still can't and then Rowan was talking to them and she's like well what if we recorded the young people playing music and we made a program and you know we could have interviews with them and that would go out on the radio so that's the plan we're working to at the moment so now we've been kind of going through who are the students we have who have stuff ready who are in a place where they want to do this and uh, then discussing with some of them you know one or two again well, well are you going to film it as well and then we kind of realized we probably should film it why not um it's not super difficult to do that, that's something they can have to show to their parents and their aunts and uncles and cousins and whoever they want to show it to. Um, and maybe, maybe we end up making something to stick on YouTube with that as well. The lights that I've used to do all the stuff that you've seen over the last couple of months that we've recorded are old, like halogen floodlights that get very hot. The weather's getting warmer now, like it's not going to be cool. <laughs> literally and to have those kind of lights let's get some lights that are not going to chuck out loads of heat and let's get some lights that kind of actually light better so that we capture stuff better so that is what it's all about and uh, yeah we start on friday so i'm filming this on tuesday and so i've got a couple of days just to get the lights out work out where we're going to put people in here and so i don't know if you can see a difference in that in how I look now but uh, if we pick up the camera we have one light over there and behind me 
as in all these things, you get what you paid for. And we paid for these about a fifth of the price of perhaps the normal, most expensive or normal, like pro grade stuff that was on the local equivalent of eBay. But I think for what we're doing, they're a good step in the right direction. So here we are, it is Friday, it is half past 12, half an hour to go until we start filming for the radio concert. We've got three girls coming in this afternoon, Rowan students um, who play violin, who are gonna record standing right here, like that. Um, you will see Rowan doing a sound check. We did one just before lunch. We've got one mic up here, that's it. Our two lights are here and here. Main camera is there. And then we'll see how it goes. So we've got about five minutes before our first violinist turns up. I've just edited together Rowan's sound check. So you can have a quick look here. Right. Framing of that shot is poor. That's my fault. I need to work on that. Um, we'll go tighter on this one and then that will be the wide shot. So you get the idea. I wanted to make that quickly just so that um, the violinists who are turning up have something to see, like this is what you're filming, for those who want to film. For those who don't want to film, that's okay. Or maybe they'll see this and go, oh, okay, yeah, no, that's all right, I could do that. And um, we want to give them the option. So yeah, so that's just um, saving down now. Let me stick the cameras back, make sure everything's ready. One last check on batteries and things like that, memory cards, and we're good to go. So it's Friday night, here I am in the studio. Keyboard's here, guitar's over there, um, microphone. Just done a couple more recordings for the concert. Budo was singing um, with the girls who was playing guitar and singing, and then I have a keyboard student, she was playing keyboard, and I was singing and playing guitar with a backing track going. And uh, yeah, all good. So you can see over there, probably, that light's off, this one's still on. Um, they're doing their job, and that's all you can ask, really. And so, yeah, that's it um, for this week's vlog. Good progress on the radio concert that may also end up being a YouTube concert as well. We'll see what happens with that. Um, yeah, so do us a big thumbs up for unboxing helpful things. And uh, do leave us a comment or question if you want to know more. And do remember that together we do adventure. We'll see you next time.